So we have um, we have the Fayuka beer. Oh, check oh yeah, this out. check out these little. These Can little I buy some from you, dude? Can yeah, you ship I'll it to send me? You some. Fuck yeah. Check this out, dude. So you put these little planters right with cactus because we're from Arizona. <sighs> yeah, that's fucking and then dope. People started messaging that they wanted some, so I just did this for my house. Is that a so real gonna, like thing? Oh, it's a real cactus. Yeah. Oh, I see. Well, you the, took it out. You took out the top, filled it, and then put that in. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I thought that's how it came. Like you were gonna ship like beers inside there. And that's oh, like that the lid. Awesome. Yeah, I'm like, oh, that comes as the lid? I'm like, that's crazy. That might be great. No, this is like a, a planter, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah, oh, that's dope. This is like a, it's like a planter. You see? Okay. Yeah. yeah. So um, we got the beer. Um, there's um, the guy from, from Badfish has a, a booking agency, Providence Music. Group. Right, right. Joel. And, um, Joel. And like whenever I'm not on tour, it's, I mean, I have a passion for like, the record label side of things, the booking, the just like the business side of, of music. Yeah. Of the music industry. So, you know, I have like a, a couple of bands that I just kind of book. Uh, they're tribute tribute bands. One's a Rage tribute. Um, That's dope. Love Rage. And, you know, right now I'm not really doing anything with that because because the COVID. You can't. But, but yeah, I just think that like, um, I don't know. I've, I always had this idea that. I used to work for a bank and, and I never wanted to go back to banking. And mm-hmm. um, I made it a point that everything I did was going to revolve around music. I'm, just, I'm, I'm an artist, you know, and whenever these opportunities come by that I think is something that I can be passionate about. Um, I just, I just jump on them. So the booking thing uh, just kind of, you know, Joel, Joel hit me up and, and I kind of came in with, with a couple of these tribute bands and, and then, but the, you know, then I got the Fayuka beer, the Bravo pay thing. Okay. So they're, the, they're an app almost like Venmo where you can like, uh, just transfer money back and forth. Mm-hmm. And it really helped us out because rather than we, we started using it for our merch sales rather than using square or like QuickBooks and paying the, the merchant fees or we started using Bravo and giving people an incentive to buy our merchandise through this other app. Mm-hmm. Once they, once they send you the money for like a CD, then it opens up a, a text thread and you can text with them back and forth. So it kind of worked as like almost like a secondary social, social platform for us, for people who were directly connecting with us at the shows, buying the merchandise. Right. So then we, we were able to message them back and say, Hey, we're coming back to Baltimore, you know, um, show come to the merch table show you know buy a t-shirt through bravo get five dollars off kind of like a mix of bands in town and square and stuff it's just a way to kind of gather information and use the data to uh you know get a better return on investment yeah so bravo pay just kind of um came in and and we build a really strong relationship with them and uh Every every time we had an opportunity, we're just trying to find clever ways to use the app mm-hmm. um, and just introduce new people to the app. We just we felt and still do we feel very strongly about the app and its purpose and how it helps bands out. So 